I'm greatly influenced by Van Gogh. My whole life I have been. And I was very, a very tight painter for a long time. And then finally, I came to the conclusion I just needed to paint the way I wanted to paint. For example, here, the strokes follow the contour of the form, but they also, they all unite on the eyes. And this, this is one of the things that Van Gogh did in his uh, figurative work, in his portraits. And these are complementary colors that when you place them side by side, they cause a vibration. And I think my most interesting pieces are the ones that use that the most. Well, this is uh, obviously Monument Valley. And this is toward the end of the day when the shadows are long. And, uh, and one of the reasons that I love this painting is because here I'm using the complementary colors in a very bold way. The orange and the blue, which are across from one another on the color wheel, they, they work together so well. And then also I let my, my Van Gogh go a little bit in the sky. And uh, I, I felt like the movement of the strokes around, uh, these are what are called the mittens in the Monument Valley, the mittens. Uh, was a dramatic way to, to show this. These two pieces represent a softer side of my work. Uh, the colors are more pastel. Here there are the colors of the desert, the pastel colors of the desert. And in this other one, it's the pastel colors of the, the soft iris. I painted some of the the, the primary features of the Grand Canyon. I went to the North Rim and, and then I went to the South Rim and painted, this is called Vishnu Temple. And uh, one of the things that I wanted to show is the, the depth of color. And uh, when you're standing there, your colors are bolder, they're more orange, they're uh, more intense and slowly they they become more purple and blue as they go off into the distance. And finally, this blue could almost be a sky, but this is the haze factor that figures into the, the wonderful distance that you see at the Grand Canyon and the, and the uh, stone features. I'm thrilled to be in the Antipas Gallery. You know, when Philip called me, I was on my back porch, I was drinking coffee and uh, and suddenly this voice came out of nowhere inviting me to be a part of Scottsdale. And that meant a lot to me. Uh, you know, I, uh, artists can go looking for galleries or they can be invited into galleries. And this is a great opportunity for me. I, I love this. And this is a great gallery, my goodness. The people here are so nice.